All right, everybody. It's uh, early September. Got into some lobster mushrooms, and now we found a good patch of uh, purple gilled lactari, and they're in just a awesome, awesome stage uh, to pick. These are these are just awesome mushrooms. They kind of they kind of have this sweet corn thing going on, especially in soups. There's snapper as usual inspecting the hull. Um, these are super firm. They're nice and tight. So these are an awesome mushroom. If uh, if y'all have been passing this mushroom up, either not knowing what it is, or uh, or just don't think it's worth picking, it is worth picking. So got some there. Got a big patch of them right there. There. Here's one that's opened up a little bit. Help you look at it. As you can see, it's got these nice purple gills. They're adnate. They're attached. Pretty wide. This cap can be uh, almost white to a deep purple. Most of the time when I find them, uh, it's more of this violet tan type color. And then you, as you can see, it's got the striations. If this will focus, I don't think it will. It's got, there we go. It's got these striations on the stalk. So this is a very easy mushroom to identify. Now make sure you don't, just like as if you're hunting bluets, make sure you're not misidentifying this with the purple court. That would be, uh, that would be a bad deal. Uh, but this has no veil. So a court would have a veil. So, or a cobwebby veil, I believe is how it's described. But this is an awesome mushroom. As you can see, this one's a little more open. Uh, they do get pretty buggy when they get aged. Um, so it's best if you can find them, as with most mushrooms, if you can find them where that's, that cap's enrolled. 